You used to spend your weekends getting completely shit-faced at birdies, but those were different times. This weekend, a friend took you bird watching. You didn't really know what to expect because you're not a bird person. It's not like you're anti-bird. Birds are chill, you enjoy hearing them outside your window, but you're not as bird curious as other people, you know? You just haven't gotten to that stage in life where you study them and identify them and say things like, hear that? That's the new world warbler. What a tiny weaned beauty. Anyway, you were total shit at bird watching. You couldn't figure out your binoculars and you didn't bring your glasses, so you just kind of pretended to see whatever bird was being pointed out to you. It was still interesting. The bird tour guide was a badass and you appreciated their obsession. You also enjoyed the enthusiasm of the people on this bird tour and realized you like watching bird watchers more than you like watching birds. It was cool to watch them get excited about shit, and you understood the dopamine rush they must get from seeing a bird they have never seen before. But again, you're really bad at this sport, and your mind started to drift into a secret kill Mary fuck game you were having with various members of the group, and then you were thinking about some guy you don't even talk to anymore, and then you realize you're not really talking to any guys right now, and is that why you're in such a state of peace and tranquility? Before you knew it, the bird tour was over, and you just had dick on your mind, and while you and your friend were heading back to the ferry, you couldn't help but notice a soccer game taking place, and you thought you saw some hot guys even though you're not into sports ball, but maybe you're just horny, or bored, or borny, you're borny, whatever. It was a good time though. You like stepping outside of your comfort zone and doing weird shit with your friends. You definitely want to do more things like that, and came home sun-kissed, exhausted, and satisfied. Then today you met up with your old boss, and as you were leaving the restaurant, a bird shit on her head. It was a fucking mess to clean up. It was like the shit of a bird living on a diet of tequila, Taco Bell, and cocaine. Did the bird just fly in from birdies? Good grief. You didn't even know that bird shit came like that. You both joked about how it's good luck, but it felt more like good luck getting all that shit out of your hair. Oh my god, your poor boss. You wondered if birders could identify the type of bird based on its shit, or how many of them get shit on. Has a bird ever shit on another bird? Man, you miss drinking at birdies. 